Mm. Did you tell him? Yes. It's coming. Oh, okay. Do I intend to tell you that now? Okay. Yeah, that's good. You call me, sir. Hello, yeah, okay. Please come and check. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Aloy. Sir. On my wife's suggestion, yeah? I have decided not to wait until that three months I told you or I gave you to uh, make up your mind on what you want to do for a living before I engage you into some type of uh, income generating activity. Um, That's exactly what I wanted, sir. Thank you. That's great. My wife... My wife told me you once worked as... Uh, as an assistant manager of a hotel before you left the country, is that true? Yes, I did. Brilliant. You see, my hotel manager just secured a job in one of these new generation banks. How about you take over from him? For a salary of 200,000 Naira every month, is that okay? Uh, what me? Yes. Um, yes, I will. Thank you, sir. Yes, um, I, I will do the job. Thank you. Ah, oh, Nelly, you are such an angel as a sister. Thank you for suggesting this. You're welcome. <laughs> you mean the whole world to me. Oh, I mean to say you and yeah, my husband mean the whole world to me. Anything for you. Listen, congratulations, okay? Thank you, sir. All right. Welcome. May God continue to bless the two of you. Amen. May all your heart desires be granted. Amen. 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 I'm sure our mother will be so happy wherever she is right now. Amen. This is just the beginning. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. Right. Thank you, sir. That's who she is. Oh, our green snake. In a green grass, so that's who she is. So then, that's who she is. Ah, a green snake. So, Aloy, you said you're good to go, yeah? Yes, sir. At least, very minute, sir. That's great. Thank you so much for the job. <laughs> you're very welcome. Um, I must add that your hotel is really in a class of his own. It's top-notch. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the compliments. I actually have something like this in Port Harcourt, you know? Yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah. Um, you are way more successful than your humble way gives away. <laughs> Thank you once again. You see, I tell people that we are nothing and we can achieve nothing without the mercy of God. That's my life's philosophy, though. And I strongly believe that success is noiseless. I like that. Success is noiseless. Oh. So like I said, um, you'll be living and working here, OK, until we find a good house for you. But for now, this is your room, OK? So good luck in the job. Thank you very much, sir. God bless you. Thank you. I, I, I promise I won't disappoint you. Thank you, sir. Oh, God bless, bless you. That's all. Hey, babe. Yes, honey. Let's leave him to unpack, okay? Um, yes, <laughs> honey. Yeah. Uh, I'll meet you downstairs, okay? Just give me a few minutes with my brother for some serious evening stuff. Oh, okay, that's fine. I'll just, uh, I'll be downstairs, okay? All right. All right. I'll just wait for you. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me you engineered all of this. Uh-huh, I did. <laughs> Raymond may be deeply trusting of me, but it's anything but it don't. Damn it, we were so lucky the last time. And I didn't want to stretch that luck any much longer by having you on that roof. 
So I had to come up with this idea of the job and having you move in here. With this, we will not just have unlimited freedom to screw each other without the fear of being caught by him. And also, I know you'll be making so much money in here. Hope you like that. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I was even going to suggest something like this to you. <laughs> no, you are so sweet that <laughs> anything for your baby. Anything for your sweet. Sweet, sweet. <laughs> she pretends a lot, lies a lot. So full of the seeds. Claims to be so nice, but in the inside, she's the devil you she lives a fake life, all her smiles Where are you, God? God of the poor, she won't be here Hi, Henry, Auntie. here you are Your admission letter from University of Malaysia Ah, thank you very much <laughs> Thank you, Margaret <laughs> Auntie, thank you very much, my God bless oh. you Come on, get up. Thank you. Ah, thank you so much. It's nothing. Oh, where's your Jim. Thank you very much. I have honor. You have to get him ready. In a day or two, we'll be traveling to Abuja to process his visa. She like a man. Are you the one you have? He's ready. Are you sure? Even now. Are you not ready, my boy? Uh, Papa, I'm ready. I'm very much ready, man. Sure? Yes, yes man. Yeah, would you know? Very well, then. So, what do I offer you? Anything, my dear. Anything. Anything? Yes, anything. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Excuse me. All right. I'll be back. Right tomorrow, God come. Wickedness of men have taken up. Nelly, the porter was right after all. You have been cheating on me. Nelly, you have been sleeping with your brother. And you bastard! Uh. You have been sleeping with my wife in my own hotel! Yes, sir. Uh, no, sir. No, sir. Uh. For how long has this been going on? Wait, who's this guy really? Go get the key from the fat idiot and lock the door. Okay, okay. Just up. Keep pointing. Oh, if you move, I will shoot you. Just up, hurry up. Be glorious. Yes, yes. Go down. Your own case go to the friends.
Come here. Come, come, come. Oh, come, 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 come. You deserve some alcohol. Come, come. Oh! Idiot! Are you? <laughs> You really want to know who Aloy is and how long he's been screwing me? Ah! <laughs> Such a fool. You want to know who he is? And for that, you hired this miserable idiot to spy on me? Well? <laughs> Aloy here, the sugar boy, <laughs> baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Aloy here is not my brother. All that was an elaborate lie that we made up to bring ourselves within easy reach of each other. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He has in fact been my boyfriend since I met him after leaving secondary school. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have not loved any other man but him. I met you. I seduced you. <laughs> and agreed to marry you based on a plan we both had. A plan? to get into the heart of your business and dupe you a huge amount of money. And I looked to Canada and get married. We almost succeeded. And... What are you talking about? Nelly, do you realize you're speaking to your husband? Your lawfully wedded husband of eight months? husband of eight months. You are just a fool. He's even, he's even more useless than I thought. Ah. Oh, hobby. Have you ever wondered why this beautiful woman here has never taken in for you? <laughs> Don't worry about that. I'll help you. <laughs> oh, come on. I have taken in for you three good times. But I had them aborted. What? I can't. I can't imagine my beautiful self carrying and giving birth to a child of a man I never loved. That's ridiculous. You're losing it. You're so senseless. You fool! Oh, baby. Mm. You know I love you so much. And I love you too, baby. You're so sweet. <laughs> but anyway, don't worry about that. Worry about what becomes of you and this animal henceforth. <laughs> ah, you're such a fool. Because my baby here, this sweet dick here, this man after my heart, <laughs> we both has gone far to watch you stand by and destroy what we have. I won't let that happen. Baby, can I, can you please give me my phone? Sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> here, baby. <laughs> Nelly, what are you trying to do? Mm. Who are you calling? Are you trying to kill me? Hello, Dunga. Oh, yes. Um, Aloy and I have an urgent work for you and your guys. Yes, can you please come over to the hotel right now? 
Oh, God. <laughs> In a green grass, that's who she is. To my heart. <laughs> Whipot has gone far to watch you stand by and destroy what we have. I won't let that happen. Baby, can I? Can you please give me my phone? Sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Nelly, what are you trying to do? Mm. Who are you calling? Are you trying to kill me? Hello, Dunga. Oh, yes. Um, Aloy and I have an urgent work for you and your guys. Yes, can you please come over to the hotel right now? Oh, God. <laughs> In a green grass, that's who she is. That's who she is. Oh, a green snake. In a green grass, that's who she is. That's who she is. Oh, she pretends a lot. Lies. Oh. I guess you like it in here. Mm -hmm. Nelly, you used togs to push your husband into the trunk of a car. And those bastards drove for over four hours. With me inside that Halloween space, without a care if I suffocate to death or not. What have I done to you? Have I wronged you? You have no conscience? You hired that stupid porter to spy on Aloy and I, and you- I didn't hire anyone to spy on you. Besides, I never had any reason to think you were cheating on me. The young man was just a man of conscience. That was a stupid conscience he had then. He had? <laughs> Did you just speak about him in past tense? What have you done to that innocent boy? He was not innocent. When he chose not to mind his damn business, he became guilty as hell. Mm. He sentenced himself to death. And by so doing, Nelly and I have no regret supervising Donga and his boys carry out the execution about an hour ago. And he did what? The fool's corpse is now resting at the bottom of River Niger with a brick tied to it. Jesus. Oh, please shut up. Shut the fuck up. Sign this check if you don't want to suffer the same miserable fate. Huh? Nelly, this is a check to my business account. What are you up to? Both of you. Very simple. We are going to leave the country immediately. Fly to a foreign land and start our life all over again. You heard them right, Raymond. The amount on that check is 676 million naira. Of 678 in the account in question, and it is in my name. Sign the check. Aloy? Yes, baby. Please don't tie his so you can sign the check. Sure. Don't bother, you swine. I'd rather die than allow you devils have a pin of my asset. Oh, no, baby. You don't have to waste your energy. Okay, you have better things to do with your energy. Baby, this fool is insulting us and wasting our time. I know. We have more time to spare than he can ever waste. But she chose to break it. I gave her all my trust. 
and she betrayed my trust Though I'm with someone and yet I am lonely What have I done wrong to deserve this? Is it a crime to fall in love and maintain that love? Is it a crime to show someone how much you love her? Is it a crime? Is it a crime? Someone please tell me I gave up my heart But she chose to break it I gave her all my trust and she betrayed my trust Though I'm with someone Mama! Ah! Mama! Please! Why? I made it! I made it! Are you serious? I made it! This is my passport! I made it! See, see, see! See, see! Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm so so happy. My God bless you. Hey, thank you, ma. Thank you. Thank you, ma. Thank you very much. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. It's a crime to show someone how much you love her. Is it a crime? Is it a crime? So <sighs> Dunga. <sighs> Dunga. Please. I'm dying. Help me. Dunga, please. Save an innocent man. I beg you. Five days without food. And barely 24 hours without water. I can't stand it all. I can't stand it. Please, help me. Help an innocent man. I know you can hear me. I know you and your boys can hear me. Please, I don't want to die. Dunga, I don't want to die. Half, half a glass of water will do. Please, I'm thirsty. I need to drink water. I need to drink water. Half, half a glass of water will do. I. Listen. I can buy. I can buy water. I can buy the water, please. Do grab this. Please. 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 Uh. Do grab. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. Please. Dunga. 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 Please. 
I can pay, I can pay for half a glass of water. Huh? Please, I'll give you 50,000. Dunga, I'll give you 50,000 for half a glass of water, please. I need to drink some water. I'm thirsty. I'm going to die if I don't drink water. Please! Dunga, please. Okay, okay. I want to buy it. I want to buy water. Listen, I can pay for water. Okay, I'll give you a hundred thousand. Dunga, I'll give you a hundred thousand. Please, give me water to drink. I can pay a hundred thousand for half a glass of water. Dunga! Okay. I'll give you a million! Dunga, please. I'll pay a million naira for half a glass of water. Please. I need to drink water. I don't drink water. I'm going to die. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. Uh, Alright. Two million. Two million for half a glass of water. Please. Dunga, three million. Three million. Give me half a glass of water for three. Please, I just want water. I can't even pay four million. Four million, Dunga. I'll pay you five million. Talk to me, Dunga. Stop ignoring me. I'll give you five million. Damn it! Shut up! I can't shut up, Dunga. I just need water. Please. I want to die. Alter another world now. Come in there. Cut your finger and force you to drink your garden drunk and quench your garden test. Just another world. What a world! But she chose to break it I gave her all my trust And she betrayed my trust Though I'm with someone And yet I am lonely What have I done wrong To deserve this? Is it a crime? to fall in love and maintain the law is it a crime to show someone how much you love her is it a crime is it a crime someone please tell me my heart but she chose to break it I gave her all my trust and she betrayed my trust though I'm with someone and yet I am lonely what have I done wrong to deserve this in love and maintain the law is it a crime to show someone how much you love her is it a crime is it a crime someone please tell me Ah. Oh, oh my goodness.
this. Wow, what a ride. Baby, mm. will I ever stop loving it with you? Same question I ask myself in my mind all the time. I love you. I love you more. <laughs> ah, you are so sweet. <laughs> oh. mm. Hold, hold on. That's my phone. All right. Yes, hello, Junga. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Jeez. Junga, nothing must happen to Raymond, okay? Yes. Of course, we need him alive. Yes, we need him to sign the check. The dead do not sign checks. Oh, can you just listen? Even if we forge his signature, the bank will not approve any check above 100,000 naira without hearing from him for a second tier confirmation. Oh, please. Fine. Revive him. Do whatever you have to do to keep him alive. Keep him alive. Keep him breathing. Okay? Oh, yes. Fine. Fine. Um. Aloy and I will be on our way to that place now. Nothing must happen to him. Um, baby, what is going on? What's, what's happening? Um, baby, what's, what's going on? Tunga said Raymond almost gave up. After begging them for food and water for several hours and they denied him. You, you, you see what I told you? I warned you about depriving him food and water when you came up with the idea. But you wouldn't listen. Oh, please shut up. Alloy, shut your lazy mouth up. Okay? Pick your dress. Dress up so we go there to ensure his survival. In case you don't know, there's a limit his family, friends, and staff will believe our lies about his urgent business trip to abroad. And I don't know how I'm going to explain that. Alright, let's get dressed. Oh, nothing must happen to you. Is it a crime to fall in love and maintain the love? Is it a crime to show someone? Oh, well, that's enough. Stop! And stop! Get out! You're nothing but a fool. Are you now convinced that we are not here today to play? Or to play with you as usual? Everything you've been receiving has just the beginning. <laughs> if my lawyer gets tired, I will allow Dunga and his men unleash the demon in them on you. And I'm sure you know what that means. Hmm? What was I doing thinking you were smart? Hmm? What have you not tried on me? Is it hunger? Is it thirst? Huh? Is it sleep deprivation? You even threatened to kill, to assassinate every member of my family. Now what have you? Nothing. You are this fool. You have miserably failed 
to break my will. So what makes you think physical assault will do the magic? That's because when it comes to pain, every human has his endurance limit. That's it. Fool. Not an angry, cheated man like me. Both of you betrayed my trust. And he obviously took you and your lousy vagina away from me. God forbid that I should do anything. That will make both of you have access to my wealth. I'd rather die than sign that check.
But once I paid, it won't on your behalf to get back from him. Yes. Oh, no. That's a no-go area. Don't you understand? The robbers wrecked me completely. In fact, those firm lands as things stand are the only things I have left. The only asset I have left. <coughs> I don't understand, my man. What are you talking about? In fact, I was <coughs> coming to your house before you came in to give you this to sign. So please, go through and sign for me. What is this about? An agreement drafted by my lawyer to the effect that those farm lands are my to do with as I like. Until you pay me back the money, I give a warm on your behalf. See, don't think about that. Try to understand me. I am not trying to punish you people. No, God forbid I should do a thing like that. I'm just looking for something to hold on to in this crisis moment. As a matter of fact, if you don't raise that money to give me back, I'll be left with no options than to sell off the farmlands eh? in a day or two. Sign. to ask you, ask for your help. To raise 750,000 Naira required for Henry's travel to Malaysia to start school. Right. Yes. I scheduled. How could you? Honora, if you don't sign this, I'll make contact and have Henry's admission and the visa cancelled immediately. Hey! Maybe. Are you signing? Maybe. Please. 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 Help Maybe. us, please. 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 Help us. It's not about helping you. It's about me. I'm left with nothing. So this begging is not going to take us anywhere. You want your, your son to travel to Malaysia, isn't it? Yes. So how do I make it happen? How do I survive when I get to Malaysia? Please, are you signing or not? Uh, uh, please, where can I sign? Oh, no, are you asking me this? Are you daft? You went to school, right? You're well later, so why are you asking this? Sign there, please. Do how about the oh come on on oh, no. I told you that the robbers wrecked me. I have been depending on Afunwa for sustenance since after the robbery. You can go to him. He could be of help, you know. Afunwa? Yes. I don't get it. What don't you get? Afunwa, your brother. Uh-huh. Who recently returned from prison? Exactly. Well, I gave him a huge amount of money to start a transport business. So, as we speak, Afunwa is doing remarkably well. Go to him. He could be of help. It's not a matter of help, Chidi. Chong, just calm down. Marble that I get you people well. Uh, you see, they're saying that 
Somebody who has a carryover today can build a flyover tomorrow. It's very true because it's happening in my life. It's so long I came out of uh, prison. Just the money my bag gave me just about two months ago. But right now, like one your number is in the hiti hiti. I am hiti hiti right now. So lending you the seven hundred and fifty thousand naira is, is is not a problem. But the only thing is that I need good collateral. Afongwa, <sighs> everything I told you here is the truth and nothing but the truth. Without the farmlands your sister took from us, we have nothing in form of collateral to give you. Just help us. As soon as Henry starts sending money home, we will pay you two million naira cash. He promised to ask the Malaysian University to put his admission on hold for one year. That is after registration in the school in order to enable him work and earn money to pay you and my bill back. The people he asked said such a thing is allowed in the Malaysian university system. Please help us. Well, that is good thinking uh, by your son. But um, without collateral, it is no deal on my side. Nay, Biko, help us. You are our last hope. It's just that place we are staying. Our compound is the only thing we have left. Not in it. I'm wasting your time. You are wasting your time. You are wasting your time. You are wasting your time. Is that how I'm going to learn? Biko, Biko, try and Try and Try and Try and Yes, uh, try and the hunter, if he can shoot without missing, then they will fly without fetching. So, my dear, I can't help you. Oh, no. He's so good. Oh, dear. Oh, good, good. I'm my man. I've said my mind. Inside, get me the merchant visa and the documents that I gave to you. Come bring it. Auntie, you I don't want to repeat myself. Go in and get them for me. Now, we are not quarreling. Why are you demanding for I made the necessary contract, paid the money required to get the visa and the document? Have you forgotten? No. So, those are technically my properties. Unless you want to repay me the 1.2 million naira I spent to procure them for your son. Go in and get them. If I leave this place without those documents, I am going to call in the police, arrest all of you, and ask them to detain you indefinitely. Uh, please, ma'am. Oh, please, 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 please. I don't need this begging. Stop. Afunwa. Stop this car and take me to the police. Please, please. please. Uh, 
the money. Which of them? Is it the 750,000 for the travel or the 1.2 for the visa and the document? Get the 750,000 Naira first. Then, others could be sorted out. Ma, please. Please, ma, help us, please. We are not an ungrateful family. Please, ma. Even God helps those who help the poor. Please. Really? Afunwa. And then start this horse. Mother, mother, mother. Just one minute. Um, Anwar, is, is this your daughter? Yes, and what? Uh, uh, I will accept your proposal of the other day to give you the 750,000 Naira. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. If you will add that uh, if you fail to pay me as I agreed, I take her. Yeah? Take who? Your daughter. She's good collateral. Yes, just swear to it before the elders and sign a document to that effect before the police and uh, the money is yours, you have the money. Afunwa, that can only happen the very day I drop dead. I'd rather commit suicide than have you go into such an agreement with my name on it. How did you travel? Well, contact me if you change your mind. I was only trying to catch you. People could see my phone, leave this place. Leave! Look at you! As old as you are! Is this not your granddaughter? Yes, yes, yes. Leave! Shameless old man, look at you. Is she not your granddaughter? Wicked man! That will never happen in this family. I would rather die!
a woman who refused to give us the money. Even when I offered him this compound as collateral. God. God. What have we done wrong? Where are we going to get such an amount of money within this short time? I will do it, Papa. You will do what? Use me. Use me as collateral to get the money from Afuma. Why? Look over here, everyone. That's a Kenneth's grief staring at us. If the first son of this family could die while working for the good of this family, then why should I sit back and watch such an opportunity with huge potentials that could end our suffering slip away from us simply because someone wants to use me as collateral? For God's sake. For God's sake, Nancy, you are a human being, not a piece of property. No, Mama. No. Only human beings with dignity are called humans. The rest of us, the rest of us are nothing but subhumans made so by poverty. Let's stop living in denial of what is clearly a reality if we must change it. Papa, I will do it. Let God be God. It is time to end the suffering. <laughs> it is time, Mama. <laughs> it is time. Mama. Papa. You look tired. Come, come and sit down. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, no. Huh? We, the elders of Amachara in Indoba's community, intervened to secure your release and that of your wife just because the people asked us to. Thank you. Wait, I have not finished. They did not do that because they believe you were innocent. Neither do we. Onoa, ensure that our great daughter Mabel is released from the hands of Malaysian authority. Uh -huh. We know nothing about. Shut up, you bad luck. What did you just call bad me? Bad luck! That's what you are. You and your whole family, you are ah. bad luck. Even that wall lying in the grave. Hey, hey, hey. Anyone that comes in contact with you, meets with one misfortune or the other, you are complete bad luck. Stop saying that. Look at Babel. What did Babel do for you to visit her with such evil? Just for trying to help you? What did she do? Which is a wizard. Mazikalo. Mazik. Shut up. Oberamus. Small witch. Junior witch. Listen. If Mabel does not safely return to this community, Amachala, Ndiobase, hmm, three of you will be ostracized from this community. Oh. 